You're not boring when you study. Let your creativity flow through. Hi, I'm Catherine. I'm currently studying to get my Diploma of Graphic Design with Tractor Design School. Today I want to showcase one of my subjects you learn in the online course and show you how much fun you can have. I've chosen to showcase the subject of drawing. It was a hard choice as I have enjoyed all of my subjects but I will show you one of my assignments I got to do in drawing which was my favourite because I got to showcase my love of horror movies. After reading the brief for the assignment, it's time to get to work. First thing we do is attack the research. I know what you're thinking, how boring, but it's not. You get to look at how you get to look at cool websites and see what other people have created and you get to research stuff you like. Now, we've researched so much, it's time to brainstorm. That means we need to start thinking about what we want as a topic for our brief. It's a great way to get the ideas flowing. As you can see, I had a wide range of things I brainstormed that were not related. Basically, I thought of all the awesome things I'd love to draw and would like and would look awesome. Now you've brainstormed, you do some sketches of some of the ideas to get a feel for what you think might work. As you can see, I did two from each category. Once you decide what category you are going to do, with it's time to pick two pictures you'd like to replicate. These are your refer reference pictures that you will use to replicate and draw freehand. As you can see, I chose horror. So now it's working drawing time. That means draw, draw, draw. But remember, these aren't meant to be perfect. They are just rough sketches to get an idea of how you want the image placed in your mocker. I chose to do p pillows. Nothing more comforting than a horror movie bad guy on a fluffy pillow, right? It's time to try out some media. That means you can get to scribble on some with some pens, paints, textures, whatever you like really. You use different colours, different pressures and different patterns. Now you get to try those medias out on working drawings and see what works and what doesn't. Do you need an outline? Is the pencil way to go? Should you use textures? Do you want a hard pressure or a light pressure? This is where you make your final decisions on what you want your final images to look like. And remember there are no mistakes. It's all trial and error before you get to the final product. Now you've made your decisions on media, it's time to draw these bad boys up full size and finalise them ready to mock up. I went with pencil and a hard pressure to make the colours stand out. And here they are, my mock ups on pillows. I would definitely feel safe with these guys around. This to me is the best part, seeing your final finished work on mock-ups. Makes it feel so real. There really is no better feeling. I have been lucky enough to do this subject by studying with Tractor Design School. If, I wasn't, if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't get to do these awesome subjects and learn so many things and even fall in love with these things I never knew I would. It's time to let your imagination run wild, a bit like my hair. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.